hi guys this is rosa from rosa's resources um real quickly i just wanted to do a real quick video for you guys we want to talk about suffering um and that suffering can mean first let me just say by the way the reason why i'm talking about suffering is because a lot of times people think like suffering you will never get over your suffering but your suffering um, I want to say it makes you into a better person, you know. In the Bible, in um, Philippians 1.29, it says, um, not only should you believe on Christ, but you should uh, suffer in Christ as well. So your suffering is not in vain. Remember, Christ also suffered for us so that we could have everlasting life. He came here so we could purge. You understand me? So in your suffering, if you imagine if you only have happiness all the time, how would you learn? You know what I'm saying? So, um, you're suffering, whether you're suffering financially, some people lose things financially, uh, some people lose uh, love, loved ones, um, and after a while, you grow, you grow from these things. In the pain, you might feel devastated, but further down the line, you get to remember those people like with uh, good memories, you know, what they did on earth. Remember, we're not here forever, you know? So, um, even like suffering and financial losses, you build back up even better. Sometime, if you push forward and don't give up, you will come out on top. You know, so I just really want to say, um, just a quick word and, um, suffering and feeling like you're stuck and you can't, especially those, uh, suffering from domestic violence, um, just keep pushing forward and know that the day the cloud would get better, the day would get better, guys. Um, I had the suicide prevention uh, um, number, but you could just go online and look for the suicide prevention. If you need somebody to help you in the physical world, that's a good number to contact. You'll have like a therapist you could talk to if you can't talk to your family and friends because you know sometimes they judge you. These people will just lend you um, a listening ears. But better than that, you know, go down on your knees and talk to God. If you think you have to run to a pastor or run to someone to pray for you, the best prayer is praying for yourself. Pour your heart out to God and he listens. He knows what's on your heart. Soften your heart and take it to the knees and take it to God. Give him all your burden and he will soothe your soothe your pain. He will lift you up. He will strengthen you. You know, I just really wanted to come on here real quickly, guys. It's cloudy in New York and I'm just sitting here and the word was suffering. Whatever you're going through, don't think that tomorrow will be a better day. Just take it little steps at a time. You will be fine if you just keep moving forward. All right? I hope you're blessed by this message. Please leave your comment here. I'll leave your story here. What did, what did you suffer through and came out of the cloud? Somebody need to hear your story. All right? Thank you, guys.